There was a second guy back there I saw. Bunch of murdering assholes can't let any of them get out of here alive. Well, don't worry, Deke. You think you can pull this guy into their own bear traps? Let's try it. I'm currently using Premiere. I would like to use Vegas because Vegas is just a nice simple one-time payment boom done and it's always on sale. Premiere you're stuck with a monthly payment 30 I think it is per month or if you lock yourself into a year monthly payments are down to like 20 or just Premiere. It's uh, fucking expensive. I'd like to use Vegas, but I can't do the fancy edits with Vegas because the UI just doesn't allow for it. With Premiere, I can like on the canvas adjust and move things around. But with Vegas, it's... Ooh, okay. I can set those off that way. Uh, with Vegas, it's like... I don't know how to describe it. You get like a pop-out window and it's got a white square that represents your canvas and you're moving crosshairs, which is like the thing that you're trying to manipulate. But you don't really have a sense of where it lies in the scene in relation to other stuff. It'd be like trying to color in... What? It'd be like trying to color in something with your eyes closed. On a tablet. Like it's just the... Uh, it's all fucked up. So I can't do the I can't do the fancy edits with Vegas at all. So I'm kind of stuck at the premiere, but that's okay. It's just premiere is really fat, really really fat and sluggish. One down. How many of you are left, huh? A five twelve M two for operating system and apps, two terabyte for games, and two terabyte hard drives for bulk storage, which are synced to a NAS then to the cloud. You see, I. I'm a bit interested in doing cloud syncing stuff, but I don't think our internet's quite fast enough for that. They're slowly rolling out fiber. Well, were until the flooding happened. Uh, but they're slowly rolling out fiber. So maybe when we get some fiber, we'd be able to get like uh, 100 symmetrical or something like that. Maybe 200 symmetrical even. That'd be, oh, hey, that'd be cool. Dude, that don't sound fucking, like, at all good. I think you done goofed. I'll take that guy out, but... Uh... <sighs> I just got it off Amazon. Yeah, I don't, uh... I don't know of, like, a good hardware store that's not on the other ass end of Germany. Well, I can still mark you while covered. I guess I'll do that. It sounds like they took care of the dudes down below. It sounded like there's a lot of them, though. Six, six out of 14. Holy shit. It's, uh, it's a whole horde coming through, it turns out. Mark a few of them so we can kind of sort of keep track. And I'm just going to wait here a little bit. <laughs> Initial sync took around two to three days with a with a thousand megabyte per second upload. After that, you don't have too much new data. Yeah, once you get the initial done, I imagine it's a lot easier. But for us, since we're rocking, I think it's only 30 up. It'd be pretty rough. It'd be really cool to have like a big fat cloud storage for uh, like rendered videos and highlights and stuff at least. I could maybe get away if I just do that. But then I may as well just use like Dropbox or something like that. Like... <clears throat> What's going on over here? What are you dudes doing? Are you hacking over there? Okay. Well, the Zeds are down below. Um, I'll tell you what I could do though, maybe. 
Can I get a flashbang over there? Nah. Where are they even? I sort of lost the mark. They're all just below me now. Hmm. I might still throw a flashbang over there and see what I can do. Any type of explosive, I can blow that apart. Alright. Fine. They have to come way up and around, though. Uh, if I flashbang, I don't think that'll help much. At least piss him off a little bit. Sort of spread out a little bit. Oof, don't know about that shot. <laughs> you should turn around, friend. I'm out of ammo. Fancy dude you are. Okay. One left. Uh. Safer now. He was just a bit slow dying. I wonder if they had a bunker around here. I'll bet they do. They do indeed. We passed it. Alright, so those dudes like proper fucking armor with like a real machine gun or something. Where'd he die at? Think, I don't think he had this SAF thing, did he? It seemed a bit, uh, you know, earlier. Hmm. When did Yeti become so sneaky? Since my life depended on it. Dude, this game's rough. 
Hmm. Yeah, you know what? Mine now. I'll take that. I'm mostly out of repeater ammo anyway. More ammo. That's not a whole lot of ammo at all. That's really not a whole lot of ammo. Oh well. So. Ears down below. And also, their vault. Here's the hatch. Yeah, I knew you had one. Of course they, of course they got one. Of course they would have one. Would you, Deacon? Where there's one, there's multiple. Get this open. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Many of you probably don't remember the Cold War. But what are you doing, Deacon? Special kind of hell. Every time you heard a plane flying overhead, you think for sure that this is it. That's the one coming to drop the big one on us. And we live through the Red Scare. The man didn't know if his neighbor was an American who bled red, white, and blue. Communist red to the bone. Made it hard to trust. My father, God rest him, taught me the only way to be safe in dark times was to go underground. We built my first bunker with him. But we couldn't build it out in the backyard with the neighbor spying. Had to go out into the woods, a ways from the road, where no one would happen upon it. With a bunker, you knew that if the country went to hell in a handbasket, you could open that manhole cover, climb down the ladder, and you'd be safe. With your radio and your hoard of food and ammo. Things haven't changed. Better to dig a bunker than an early grave. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Realistically, Oregon. though, like don't a bunker like this is a really bad idea. Don't do this. Because, <laughs> like... How'd that work out for the poor bastards who own the one that I just cleared out? Huh? Not so good, I'm guessing. Since they were all dead long before I ever got there. Imagine, like, because people do this sometimes with, like, tornado bunkers and stuff like that, and they got a hatch. But, like, if a chair or something falls on that, you ain't getting that door. Oh, it's a heavy fucking door as is. You put any extra weight on that, you're not getting out. What do they got here? A map. Dude's so stoked about a map. 96% with the ambush? What's what's the other 4% here? Oh no, wait, that's my experience, right? I always get that mixed. It really looks like it's just like, hey, you did it. Here's... <laughs> You're progressing a bit with it. And there's like 4% more I have to do. But no, it's done. 21% of the way done with ambush camps. And I think this has unlocked the uh, explosive crossbow bolt, right? No, smoke bomb. Ugh. Got some okay. papers, notes on smoke bomb. Crafting. Yeah. yeah. It's a distraction at least. Can, rag, gunpowder. Hey, I use for gunpowder. Well, I'll take that. Uh, I don't mind. Mmm. -hmm. How much? 144 bucks. You're killing me with this. Yeah, it's worth it though. I was surprised the uh, the zombies down there knew the Molotov came from above. They're not hugely exploitable. Kind of nice. A little rough to work with, but kind of nice. Gravy Jr., Tier 1, two months. Thank you very much, Gravy Jr. Next month for your promotion. You'll no longer be a, a seaman. You'll be an able seaman, or maybe ensign. I don't remember how I have it. I think these dudes got gobbled up by the... Uh, 
by the horde that was coming through a bit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And the horde's not dead. It's still around somewhere. I guess we got their ears already, huh? Oh yeah, we loot that from afar. Uh, bear traps, like, everywhere. But where'd the horde go? This one's set off. And this one's set off. They've gone this way. No more traps. I'm gonna find them. We loot the ears as bounties. You turn them into an encampment for a little bit of money. I think a little bit of rep as well, but mostly the money. And, uh... It's it's just a good way to get a little bit of early rep with people. Hmm. Not sure where they've gone. Guess we're not getting up to the high ground for some binoculars action. Well, this kind of works actually. Just water on the left, so they may have hit the main road and wandered off somewhere, but it hasn't been that long. Yeah, it might not be a legit horde, it's true. That's true, it could have just been just a bunch of fucking zombies. Sorry. Freaks. <laughs> My mistake. I apologize. Yeah, I mean, I took out most of them. If it was a horde, it'd be nice to finish them off, because you get a bunch of experience and rep for doing that, but... Oh, well. It could be that the, um... That, that last pipe bomb that I threw took out most of them, and just a few more that came up, we took out real quick. During the, uh, end of the combat there. The guy with his machine gun and all that. Oh. Oh. Try that again, shall we? <laughs> Didn't think I'd pop off. At least that one, you don't feel too bad about banning. The one that's just like a bunch of letters and numbers for the name spamming. It's not like it's actually a hacked account. It's just a just a pure new fresh bot account. I always feel bad banning the ones that actually have like kind of a proper name. So I usually just time them out for a bit. Let Twitch handle it. So we're here, and our gas tank is actually much higher than I thought it would be. Granted, that was marking out to here, but, uh... Yeah, no, we're like, I don't know, 74% or something like that? Maybe, yeah, 69% very nice. So, potentially a huge amount of fuel is used up when you do the fast travel. You think Nightbot's a bot? Oh, come on, don't be like that. Be nice. You really think I'd allow robots in my chat? You kidding me? 
I'm me. Nailed it. What an entrance. I'm me is exactly what a bot would say. You think I'm a bot? All right, listen here, you. How many are there? Just the one, presumably. its ear down from here. <laughs> Scrap? Well, like the knife or something? So down by the creek, he says. Like beneath the bridge or so. Drinking water, don't you, you bitch? What the hell, Deke? Just let her get water. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Sergeant Quave, when you get sub subscribed, if you click the sub button up there in the menu that pops up, I think it tells you who gifted it. Uh, but I think it was from some Texagon just moments ago. Uh, you wanna... Yeah, I can't because we're in the middle of a thing. Alright, we'll leave it there for now. I'll be back for it. I hear it. There's another kid around somewhere. Quiet, but it's there. You fucking rippers, none of you are getting out here alive. Bandages? What? I, I know about bandages. Game? <laughs> Get in here. Would you reload already, Deke? God damn. I guess I'm, they know where I am, so I may as well just shoot him at this point. I'm not making that shot with this. Newt, I think. That's some anger on this guy. Oh my god, nailed it. Okay, that might have been a little bit loud for the gun. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, he's still alive. Oh, wow. Yeah, just normal. Bulletproof. First time in all that. I might up it one day, but probably not realistically. You're still alive over there, you kidding me? Go get him. No, not me. Yeah, you're like hiding behind the beam currently. <laughs> At least we're nice and safe in here. And uh, check ammo and all that. I think we pistol around a little bit here. And... Oh yeah, I can for smoke bomb, right. New thing that we learned how to make. Got about that. Angle, do you think you've got? <laughs> Deke, are you hacking? Pretty much. Channeling our inner tally on here with these jumps. Did you actually have any ammo, you think? Two, yeah, two shots. Yeah, they like never have ammo. Yeah, I'll keep what I got. You can at least make crossbow bolts on the fly. I'm not too great with the crossbow yet, but. Better than nothing. Because otherwise I'm out of the sniper rifle stuff, and then what? That's it. Has the game gotten repetitive yet? No, not at all. It took a little bit of time, like, being sidetracked doing other stuff, but... Um... No, for the most part, pretty okay. Ugh. <laughs> Should probably pick up a couple ranged weapon perks. I want the double crafting inventory space, but... Man, our gunplay is pretty rough. <laughs> Bulletproof, since you've completed the game on both PS4 and PC, what are your thoughts on the PC port versus the PlayStation? Because I've been hearing that it's, it's better on PC than PS4. Which is really surprising to me. That's like never the case. Holy shit. Bunch of them. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Residue Bolt, I don't think I'll do a whole lot against these guys with. That's mostly just for the freaks, I think. Oops. Uh, he's a bit far. Not that far, though. What are those dudes showing up now? God damn it. There's so many of them. Oh, just keep rolling. 
They'll never hit you if you keep rolling. PS4 version was almost unplayable at launch, that buggy. Can I actually believe it was better on PC? Not that you disliked it on PS4. I mean, bad launch aside, I assume they fixed it up and patched it and all that. But like, at least PC, we're dealing with uncapped frame rate and everything like that, and it, it, it controls pretty okay with mouse and keyboard, it ain't too bad. PC much better, just using mouse and keyboard instead of a controller sells it for you, but overall polish, graphics, FPS, etc. a huge improvement. Yeah, it's about it's about on par with what I've been hearing. That's really surprising. It's usually uh, the other way around. Maybe I can get around them a little bit easier this way. Is there another dude over there? Yeah, there is somewhere. Lighting up on the radar. Yeah, shit. That goes that plan. Hold on. I can maybe get around a little bit more. They don't know I'm back here. They know I'm in the general area, though, apparently. Who? Where? We good over there? Man. Nope. Yeah, look how slow the accuracy resets. It's so slow. There's gotta be a perk for that. Or maybe just the better weapons. I don't know. But oh, man, it's, r it's, uh, it's rough. <laughs> I quite liked that the little situations and stuff though, like... Maybe it changes down the road when I get better weapons and all that, but when it's like, it's me versus three dudes, I feel a bit pinned down. Like... My dude's accuracy in the crosshairs and all that, like, I gotta take aim for such a long time to line up a good shot. Like, I... I really feel pinned down. Um, so it, it's nice that the battles, they tend to be a little bit longer because of that, so you get a chance to be a little more strategic about it. How's this sealed up? Because a lot out? of the time, especially with gun stuff, you run into a situation where it's like, oh, it's you versus like three dudes, and then it's just, it's over right away immediately. 29 monitor. Wow, how the Zite has been sprinting. <laughs> Ugh, God, Ove. <laughs> Ew. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> much appreciated, Ove. Tier 1, 29 months. Thank you much. How you doing, Ove? All good? What's the ice cream this week? It better be Magnum. Magnum, cookies and cream. But I'm, I'm one of the people who always think that combat in games generally should be a bit slower because you get more time to think and plan things out and really analyze the situation. When it's over so quickly, it's just, it becomes like kind of reflex and all that, and that it's a whole gameplay element that's a little bit missed out on. And they kind of force the combat to be a little bit slow with the accuracy thing, but it ain't too bad still. It's doable. You can still pick off the people from afar. You just, yeah, it takes a little bit of time. I don't really know why I'm looting them. I'm mostly full up on stuff again, I think. Although he had a smoke bomb, he just straight up had a smoke bomb on him. Very cool. And yeah, scrap wise, we're, uh, we're set. Can I act? Do I have any skills to spend? Yeah, I, I do have two skill points. Uh, like melee combat. Repairing with scrap. That, that I want. Because scrap is easy to get, at least for now. Initial recovery and duration of stamina cocktail. Uh, move and aim a ranged weapon with more precision. Follow a melee attack with a ranged attack for massive damage. See, I don't know what that is, really. That one I don't understand very well. But I'm working my way over to carry that weight because I'm a, I'm a big fan of hoarding stuff.
Uh, I guess reduce cooldown on stamina recovery. Seems like a nice one. When stamina is depleted, now it takes less time to regenerate. Shift to sprint, which consumes stamina. Yeah. That's the idea. And also fat guy rolls. <laughs> so it regenerates a little bit sooner, I think. Damn, a lot of ammo for that. We are set for ammo. So, up here. We, uh... Climb up to that somehow. As he said, this is all boarded up, so I'm assuming there's not just a way in. We got a parkour on the over. Yeah, ammo. Yeah! One, one bolt. All right. Well, last time we had a puzzle like this, there is a vehicle that we had to push. Maybe this is something similar. Because it looks like you can maybe get up to this roof, but I don't know what I would do when I'm up there. Unless I climb across the tree. pushing a vehicle it wouldn't be up here you sure you can't jump up there just like stretch your arms out real good don't wanna nah I okay I mean like I'll I'll ramp off I'll ramp off the mountain if I gotta don't think I won't I will I will do it but this also doesn't really lead to a whole lot. How the fuck? Knock knock, hello? I don't think there's even like anything I can blow up on it because we learned about blowing our way into the outpost before but I'm not even seeing anything like that. Maybe survival vision. Help me survive. The survival instincts of breaking into a house. fat to climb that. Ah, this isn't just busted up wood shit. Just gotta set it here. Look at that ladder yeah, mechanics. I'm coming for you. I thought that was just like a bunch of railing and shit. I mean, maybe it is railing. Did I just climb up the side of railing? Mm, not really, no. <laughs> kind of, sort of, a little bit, I guess. Alright. We got it. Don't be afraid. Uh, I'm not gonna hurt you. Are you alone? Is there uh, anyone else with you? Oh man. Okay. Uh, is is this your room? It's, it's really great. Uh, are are these yours? No. Uh, Okay. That's oh. mine. This one's for gymnastics. I should have won first place, but 
Missy King, she cheated. Lisa! Lisa, you hear the gunshots outside? It's not safe here. I was now, at we... school. And my mom called me and told me to come home right away and not stop. And they would be here waiting for me and we would leave together. And I got here and there was a note that said they left with some men. And I didn't know what to do. So, so I hid. I, I, I didn't know what to do. It's all right. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, Lisa, not far from here, there's a camp. And you really ought to let me take you there. Uh, no. There are people there. There are people. I know them. It's, I'm not going to lie to you, it's a work camp. And to eat, you have to work. Life is going to be hard. No, but at least you ain't going to starve. No. Uh, no, my mom's coming here is for it, me. Okay, is this your mommy? Well, you said she didn't come home, right? So maybe she's at the camp. Mom is at the camp. I know she is. Okay. Stay close. I vote. I vote no. I vote she's not worth it. No, we don't gotta worry about them. There's. They're gone. Um. Yeah, don't sound too good. I'm gonna loot your house real quick though, if there's anything here. I I'm not sure. Maybe? Mostly no. Is there anyone down here? Oh, Jesus, kid. How long have you lived like this? Your house is a bit of a shithole, kid. What the fuck? Cheese, is that what this is supposed to be? More like mac and shit, am I right? <laughs> These pans are gross. Alright. Okay. Is she getting eaten while Yeti loots? Maybe, I don't know. I don't, did she just run off without me? Dumb kid. Making a dumb kid. I think we're okay to ignore him, right? They're way out there. I'm way over here. I don't have a silencer anymore, do I? Also, hello, PKCG. How you doing? Welcome. My Deke's doing pretty okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Mm. Not, not quite how I think that's meant to work. <laughs> uh. We shouldn't be out here. Probably okay. They killed the one, but it's okay. You're behind me, keep up. Got yourself some new shoes. Ooh. I gotta get some new house shoes one of these days. We're thinking we're gonna go for the Birkenstocks, like the premium house shoe brand. Which, uh. I'm nervous about because I've I've never bought like nice shoes before. People always say like shoes and mattresses. You don't fuck around with those. Get the nice ones. But I, don't, I always get the cheaper ones. So like spending the big money on like a really fancy shoe, it's it's a rough rough sell for me. But 
They're the ones. Yeah, house shoes. Yeah, they're just like basically sandals with like a cork base. They're just for wearing around the house. <clears throat> they're not terribly comfortable at first, but eventually the the cork uh, sinks with your feet and it matches the contour of your foot really well. And then it's just like, it's so comfortable. You forget you have them on. And if you just like need to go outside quick for whatever reason, they're nice to have on and just, you know. You could even like go shopping with them on if you want. I, I did that a couple times. Bear? Oh. Bear. All right, well, um... Almost. Not quite. Did these explode? Don't think so. Hey, little girl, you still here? Way over there, okay. Let me know if any, uh... Dudes are coming up on me, yet. Yeah? Thought there was another can over here. Ah, the barrel, that's what I had seen. Put it in! Alright, fuck it, we'll try again. Give me. It's a rollion, though. Give me that pelt! Got it. It was almost like Red Dead Redemption 2 with that legendary bear hunt I had. Oh my god, it's got the fur effects. I hate that so much. Look how blurry and shit this looks. What a terrible thing. Ugh. Gross. It reminds me of, like... It reminds me of those, like, Korean MMOs, or... Or so, like they love to have this. They're like, look how cool the hair look. No, it looks like shit. <laughs> Ugh. It looks like Deacon needs his glasses, or maybe needs to take off glasses. I'm not sure. Getting Resident Evil flashbacks now. Get on. We have to move. I uh. I hope we have enough petrol. I don't know. Did the What's pumps work? Name? Probably not. Uh, Deacon. My name's Deacon. Uh, Lisa. Lisa, how did you live out here alone for all this time? Apparently we have like infinite gas or so. My dad's a rock hound. He used to take me out here looking for thunder eggs. Thunder eggs? Uh, what is that? They're rocks, but when you cut them open, they're really pretty inside. Minerals. Okay. Damn it. That, that sounds great. I used to go all over. On that crater, the lava flow and black crater, everywhere. Do you think he's at the camp too? Uh, I don't know, kid. You know, I really hated Resident Evil 4 the first time I played it because I wasn't expecting it to be what it was, but when I revisited it with an open mind, I really liked it actually. I dig it, and like, Resident Evil 6 and all that, Someone's like... What? I'll just shoot him. Oh, alright, I won't shoot them. Stay here, find some place to hide, don't come out until I say so, okay? Alright, Jesus. 
Wow, best bullet time ever. Fuck, I think I'm ready for the big leagues. Uh, can you not? Holy shit, flattened. Dude, get dabbed on. I'm not stuck talking about you anymore. Dude, I'm deking so hard right now. Sheva. Or... Sherry? Was that the president's daughter's name? Sherry, I think it was. No, Sherry Birkin. Fuck. Is, is it the same character, actually? It might be. Ashley. That's the one. Ashley. Yeah. Ashley. Ugh. <sighs> But I even liked Resident Evil 6 and all that. Like, they're ridiculous, but when she just accepts that they're ridiculous, it's a really good time. I got a use for you. What is that? Oh, sidearm suppressor. Holy shit, nice. I'll put that on, why not? What could else go? Oh, yeah. And melee weapons I can repair nowadays. Is there... Is there like a limit to how much I can repair something? Or is it just kind of... As long as you've got the scrap, you just like keep throwing shit on? Can always do it. That's a bit bullshit. Damn, for like a tier 1 skill? I watched a 7 hour 28, vi 28 minute video yesterday on a retrospective of, of all Resident Evil games. Wow. Come on, hop on. That's that's a long retrospective. I think you could probably like well, all of them. Now, when you say all the Resident Evil games, are we talking all the Resident Evil games, or are we talking all the Biohazard games? Nah, kid, the camp. You'll be safe there, you'll see. Okay. It's a long fucking video, though, either way. Because all, all the Biohazard games, I mean, then we're talking, like, the, the Japanese releases that didn't make it over and all that. And then maybe. It's still long, though. I'm gonna ask you a question, Lisa, and I need you to think real hard. Did any of your neighbors, did they own any firearms, you know, like, uh, pistols, rifles, things like that? No. Men came and took everything. Men? Were they like the men in the tunnel, or, or did they wear uniforms like, uh, like in the army? <laughs> She's like not Death army. Beacon. God. They were really dirty, and they carried flags they made themselves. Um, Deschutes County Militia, I think. I don't remember. Did they have anyone with them? Women? <laughs> children? I don't remember. <laughs> She's not yelling nearly remember. as loud as him, Tell and it's so distracting. My best friend, but he's gone. He left with his dad to hide. Hide? I, I don't... His dad built a fallout shelter and put all kinds of stuff in it. Maps, food, water, guns, you know, stuff like that. Okay, okay, do you know where that is? No. They wanted me to come with them, but I knew my mom and dad would come back for me. It's <laughs> such a disparity. Uh, I love it. Get that fucking gate open days ago. Keep it open. If you see some assholes, then close it. How about maybe? Just a consideration. Well, who do we have here? Mrs. Tucker. Oh my god. Lisa, honey. It's okay. 
You're safe now. Mom and Dad, and everyone got sick, and I didn't know what to do, and men came, and people got shh, shh, sick, and... It's okay. You're safe now. It's a miracle. It's a goddamn miracle. We were neighbors, weren't we, Lisa? I lived just down the block. I knew her parents. Are they here, Mrs. Tucker? Honey, you know the answer to that. They are. Oh. No. They're not here. Oh. Let's go in. Get you cleaned up. Something to eat, and then, then I'll find a place for you to sleep. Take her in. Give her some food. Go see Alkai. I'll update your credits tonight. Hey, hey, listen, listen. She's she's been through a lot. Can we just let me worry about how? No, gonna... listen to me, okay? Seriously, don't work here like you do everyone else. Don't tell me how to run my camp. You want to move here? You want to help us run this? Then maybe you get some say. <laughs> don't get soft on me, Dee. Place is a shithole, man. I would have brought her to the other place. It's not much further away. You're safe now. <laughs> what do you got against what? What? What's wrong with the softy? Come on. Uh, yeah, I don't really want to be here. Shouldn't my brother be calling me at some, like, f shouldn't Boo be calling me at Get some point being me. like, Hey, Deke, just thinking about ya. And then, like, giving me a mission or something? It's been a little while. The 20% is, uh, either my experience? Or the overall storyline progress, because there's some, like, meta storylines. Or... Something. Yeah, 20% complete is the storyline. At 100%, we get the little orphan Lisa custom accent, custom skin. We get to skin the child and plaster her on the bike? That sounds amazing! But otherwise, yeah, um... Bad way to go out. Boo's right. Too many memories around here. Time to ride north, get away from here. To do that, I'll have to do some runs for Copeland's camp and for Tucker. The hot springs. Yeah, there's a lot of shit to do here. We got a lot of storylines going on. Is there already something on my map? Maybe. Oh, there is. It's a rifle, not a gun. Learn to track a deer from Copeland? Oh, God. All right, yeah, no, we can do that, I guess. I'll, uh... Um... Yeah, fuck it, I'll fast travel. Why not? This skin's too small to use. Well, we could put it... We could, like, wrap it around the, uh... Like the gas tank or something like that. Like, it doesn't need to be an entire... I don't need the whole skin. Just like a bit of it. My buddy with the burnt arm? Yeah, that's Boo. Yeah, I have no idea. I haven't heard from him in days. O'Brien. It's goddamn O'Brien. What did he say? I'm at Holius. Get the fucking gate open. Yeah, yeah, I know where that is. Hey, Boozer, you there? Yeah, Dick. I just caught a break. That Nero radio might actually be useful. I know where they're going tomorrow. Wait, I thought you said you couldn't take them on. No, I can't, but with a little luck, I can get to their chopper without being seen and... Give them hell, brother. Remember what Jack used to say? Don't ride faster than your guardian angel can fly. Like I said, Jack used to say a lot of stupid shit. Deacon out. 
All right, let's go see what the hell Nero is up to. Now, Brian, I've got some questions for you.